friends. So, um, I'm wearing makeup, so I figured, hey, we're gonna film some videos. Um, plus, it's been a while. Uh, I know a lot of you guys wear glasses. Um, these are just blue blockers that I'm temporarily stealing from my son. I personally don't wear glasses, and I'm a little bitter about it. I've always wanted glasses, but um, thanks to COVID, I'm glad I don't wear glasses because I can't imagine dealing with like glasses and a mask and everything else that's going on. Um, so I'm borrowing these from my son just for demonstration purposes. Um, I bought them from Amazon. I can share the link if anybody's interested. It was like a pack of three. Um, and I got them for my kids because they're spending all day on a screen and I'm concerned about their eyesight. So I figured this would be a good opportunity to film like a glasses testing video um, with masks. So let's get right to it. Um, I've got this gator on. I've already squeezed it on my fat head. And let me get it situated here getting all up and close and personal. As you can see, it does not fog my glasses. And you will see why in the other video. Um, and that is because instead of the air trying to go up, it's coming out. It's, it's just flying out of my face. Um, so that is why the glasses are not fogging. That's kind of a spoiler if you haven't watched the other video yet. But yeah, Gators... I guess skaters could potentially be good for glasses, but um, there's a lot of factors that go into all of this. Oh gosh, sorry, I had to take that off. There's a lot of factors that go into this. It depends on your face shape, the shape of your nose, the shape of your mask, the shape of your glasses and where you wear them on your face that um, is gonna be a factor in whether or not your glasses fog. What works for one person may not work for another. I've seen um, a lot of people talk about shaving cream, rubbing shaving cream into your lenses. I'm not a ophthalmologist or whatever. I have no idea. Google it, you know, use your own discretion. Um, I do know Walmart and I think Amazon have a product called Cat Crap. I know, but it's like a little red pot and supposedly it's great for like sports equipment, um, swim goggles, uh, whatever other sports, I'm not a sports person, but sports that require uh, protective equipment on the face where you would typically fog up. I guess this cat crap product is amazing. I don't know, I've never tried it. So anywho, um, disposable mask. This is just one I got on eBay. They were on sale, I think it was like, like five or 10 bucks for like a pack of 50. And I keep some of these in my truck for emergencies. Um, we've all been there. You left the house and you're like, shoot, I forgot my mask. So I keep some in my truck. And if I'm going to the grocery store and I know there's going to be like a million people in there, I will double up and wear a 3D over it because I don't like these. Um, they tend to like ride up into like my lower eyelid and it drives me nuts. But a fellow lunch lady shared a tip with me that if you fold the bottom over, it cups it more and it keeps it from riding up. It's amazing. So anywho, um, let's get to the glasses part. So this has a nose wire, obviously. And if you set them on there, I don't know if the camera's picking it up, but it is fogging a little bit. Maybe I can get a better seal and put it higher. Yeah, I'm still fogging. <laughs> I can't get it to work. But I'm sure most of you guys have figured out that putting your mask under your glasses can help seal it better to keep your breath from coming up. Okay, I'm still getting some fogging, but that's better. You get the point. So we did that one, we did the gator. Uh, let's do this fitted mask. This is one that I made a while ago. I love me some Forky, he's hilarious. Trash. Okay, 
Okay, so this has a nose wire. Get the glasses. That's a lovely look, whatever. Okay, I get situated here. I'm getting like minimal fogging. That's pretty good. So I think the key factor is going to be look for a mask that has a nose wire and that is going to decrease your chances of fogging drastically. Uh, this is a beard mask that I made, the hubby. It's two layers. It's got a filter pocket, no filter in it. It does have nose wire and it's a removable nose wire. Um, I didn't want to sew them in because eventually these break and then your mask is garbage if you wear glasses. So it's got a removable nose wire. Hey. I am not experiencing any fogging. That's pretty nice. I thought it was gonna fog up actually. Um, let's do this Walmart one. I thought it was funny. Keep calm and stay six feet away. I don't like these masks. I don't find them comfortable. Um, but I figured for three bucks, hey, we'll give it a try with the whole glasses situation. Okay, let's get situated here. Okay, I'm putting the glasses on top of the mask. There is no nose wire. And I'm not fogging. I'm, I'm actually impressed. I thought for sure it was gonna fog. I think the key is setting your glasses on top of the mask. And if you do have masks like this and you wear glasses, or you have a similar mask that does not have the option for nose wire, you can go on Amazon or eBay. I've even seen people, I've even seen people score them from like Hobby Lobby. Look for like nose wire bridges. And I got a pack of like a hundred for, I think it was like $6 on Amazon. And basically it's an aluminum strip. So it's very gentle, easy to bend. It's got the 3M sticky stuff on the back. It's like a sticker. And what you can do is put your mask on, peel the sticky stuff off or the sticky, oh my God, you know what I'm talking about. Peel it off, stick it on and it folds and it conforms to the shape of your nose to help prevent fogging and create a better seal. Which even if you're not wearing glasses and you don't have to deal with that, you wanna create a good seal if possible because that is what is creating a filter. Instead of having your breath shoot out from under your eyes, around your cheek or under your chin, you want the fabric to filter your cooties before the air disperses into a public area. Nobody wants your cooties. So if you have masks that don't seal good, there's, there's hacks you can do to help that. Okay, so this is one of my three layer masks. It's a, no, I lied. It's a 3D two layer mask. And it's got a nose wire, removable nose wire. Oh, glasses are on my head. Set it on there. and I'm not fogging. That makes me so happy. So I've had lots of positive feedback from my 3D masks, which makes me so happy. I mean, my goal has always been to make available, comfortable masks that are as safe as possible, safe as I could possibly make them. But to hear that people with glasses love my masks makes my heart so happy because it sucks. I can't imagine wearing glasses and having them fog up all the time. You can't see where you're going. Like my anxiety would spike through the roof. So yeah, this hearing that this works out for most people it has, it just, it warms my heart. And I think it's because of the, obviously the nose wire and the shape of the mask, it's more triangular. 
So if I turn it sideways, you can see it's got like a triangular shape to it. It's more angled. So I think it creates a better seal around the nose area and it's also more comfortable to set your glasses on. Um, what is a different one? Let's try this KN95. Get it situated. Okay, I'm getting some fogging and I wonder if it's because I don't have a good seal here. Hmm, I'm still fogging. getting a little bit here, but it's not bad. It's better than when I first put it on. <laughs> As I fog up like hella. You guys get the point. Look for a mask that has a nose wire and play with uh, your seal, move your mask up and down your face um, and play with where you wear your glasses. This is my son's Adidas mask, it's just a uh, two-ply with a filter pocket. There's no filter in it, and it's a fitted mask, but there's no, there's no nose wire here, so I'm interested in seeing how it's going to perform. Put that up. I don't know if you can see that, but I am, I am fogging. Maybe if I move this higher. No, I'm still fogging. Lower. It's still fogging. All right. If you wear glasses, don't buy an Adidas. <laughs> don't buy an Adidas fitted mask. <laughs> I don't know. I wouldn't. You do you. Um, but yeah, I think I think that was all of them. Thanks for hanging out. Sorry the video is so long, but it was quite a pile and I tried not to ramble too much. But yeah, I hope you guys found this helpful. Put my glasses back on so I feel sophisticated. I hope you guys found that helpful. Um, if you guys know of any other tips, tricks, or hacks, feel free to share. I mean... We're all in this. We're all in the same situation. So if you know something that might benefit somebody, why not share? You could help somebody else out. Um, and if you guys want links for these or anything else, feel free to let me know. I can post them in the comments or just message me and I'll send it directly to you. So anywho, hope you guys have a good day. Take care. Stay safe. Thanks for all you do. Thanks for your support. Okay. Bye, guys. Oh, like, subscribe smash that like button or something. <laughs> okay, bye.